Now we're gonna give him extraordinary. Let's see what that does. Oh, all right, that might do it for us. Oh no, you did not. You did not. You just hit it. Alrighty guys, so Gunshy Mori back here with another video. And as I said at the last episode, uh, it's time. They've been released. The Acrocanthrosaurus is out. Yeah, so what we're gonna do here first, before I even worry about trying and getting uh, him in the cryo, or not, bleh, ow. Before I even try and worry about getting him out of the cryopod and looking at this guy's stats, we're gonna get this Acro in a cage. Now this is the scary part, because I have to land and put together the cage with him on that side of the valley let's make sure i have my bear traps out and ready wrong one okay so we want a relatively flat spot is it just me or is he coming this way i think it's just me i need a relatively large cage okay there we go now, what I gotta do here, one there, one there, okay. Gotta wait for those to set, and then we can get started. Okay, I think my bear traps are in position now. That took a little time. Okay. Stand in the cage so that way he runs in. Come on. Come on. Thank you. That works. He's sealed in. Hi, buddy. Hi. Okay, we got one acro in a cage. These guys look so menacing now, I'm not gonna lie. I am loving the TLC that Garuga gave them. This thing is scary. Oh, also, your stats suck! Oh, this is the only 150, though, I've had show up on the map. I'm debating. Because I highly doubt I'd get another one within the next four hours. This one took me a good three hours just to get to spawn in. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know, I know, I know. I'm debating on whether or not I want to tame you. You know what? Alright, and as in the purpose of the video, yes, we are. So... One, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine. Okay, nine shots. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten shots. And he can damage metal. I'm noticing that. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I might be at this for a bit.
What was that? I don't know what that was, but I'm not going to worry about it. One, two... Oh, it's baiting me! It's baiting me! It's a false! It's a false one! He's baiting me in! You see? It's a different one. He's baiting me. He knows what he's doing. Oh, it's a bait! It was the bait! Oh, what was that? Did he enrage or something? There we go. Wait, is he out? He's out! He's out! Oh, okay. Okay. Also, I fell for the bait. <laughs> I can't believe I fell for the bait. You got me. You got me. I'll admit, you got me with it. You had got me with it. Sadly, I have all... The, all right, I have all... Was it the four events? You got the Turkey Trials. You got Christmas. You got Love. And do we have another one? I think it's only those three, right? Yeah, because we don't have a Halloween event. And the Easter event isn't out yet. I think. Is Easter out? Is the Easter event out? I have to check. You know what? Easter is probably not going to be out until next week because it's not even the 31st yet. Also, if you guys haven't noticed, I got a little guy running around following me. I got that from fighting the Alpha Broodmother. Now, since I, was able, since I was able to change up my loot drops and all that, there you go. You can see them. I got me a Broodmother Chibi. I wish there were mo more Chibis for the bosses, but I think all, right now the only way that you can get that is either by spawning it in or if you go in and change your loot drops like I did. I always like it so that way the Broodmother drops their Chibi, just so that way it's a way to get it. And it's also not a very high chance. Not at all. So, as well, let me, while I'm thinking about it... Ooh, nope. Taming in progress. Boom. Boom. There we go. So there, I can see him for a bit, and I'm gonna let him starve up here. And then, once he's starved up, we're gonna give him some food. Okay, so he is starved up quite a bit. So I don't want to let him go anymore because I'm afraid. He... Oh, I got the biotoxin here. We'll hit him with a lot of biotoxin real quick. So we'll hit him with the biotoxin first. Then, now we're going to give him extraordinary. Let's see what that does. Oh, all right. That might do it for us. Oh, no. You did not. You did not. You just hit it. Did he? Did he? This came out as a 25. 225. Okay. I thought he just got hit. I'm actually surprised he got 100%. Like, he got 100%. Not 99.9. .9. He got a hundo. That's the... Like, an, a perfect 100% is the only way you can get a 225. And it is... Honestly, sometimes one of the hardest, even if you have all the right kibbles and all that, for some reason, you still get like a 99.9. .9. Boo, yeah! You know what, buddy? You were useless to me, but as long as I don't get a guy with better health, hey, you, you win. You win. Uh, I'll keep you just because you have 41 points in your health. That is, that is awesome. I'm so glad we got an acro. Now... I am at the end of my day. I've been going all day. I've done two caves today, my last two. And all this weekend, I did work on the base, getting me tech, getting all this stuff. So I need need to break, need to take a breaky. But you know what the best thing is, though? When I come back from my break, hopefully I have more acros spawned in. And... 
once I have more acros spawned in, I can go get me a good acro, breed, breed it up, and then we can go and fight the alpha dragon. Now, I, like, we're going to hold off on doing, like, the whole thing. Like, I will personally... No, well, maybe not. Well, you know what? Before we do the dragon, I will go get these guys all, like, bred up. But I need to go take a break, so I don't want to do any more today. So, I need to go take a break. But I will go show off the new acro abilities before and during the ac... Or, bleh, I can't talk. Alrighty guys, so that's going to be it for this episode, so if you found yourself at any point liking this, please do remember to hit a like and the subscribe, and as well remember to hit the notification bell so that way you guys get notifications on when I post. And one more thing, I am currently running a YouTube channel membership goal, so what that goal is is we're currently trying to reach 10 members and once we hit that member's goal we will be opening up an ARC server. Yes, and only once we hit that 10 members goal we will be opening up an ARC server. Um, it's only $1.99, so please do consider it. And anyways, this has been Gunshy Mori, signing off. Peace.